Hello my friends, Mr. Nomad Ben here. So today's adventure is kind of an unboxing and test drive kind of video today. So a small story before I reveal what I got. When gas started going over $4 a gallon, and it was getting between like four and maybe $4.50, uh, probably about a little over a month ago. And you know, I know I live locally, I work locally uh, in my town I live in, but at the same time, gas is gas, and I want to save as much gas as I can to go on some adventures for you guys. And um, even here in town, even that takes up some gas, even if I work less than 10 minutes from where I, uh, where I live. So um, considering even that, I still want to save some extra gas. And I've been losing a significant amount of weight. I want to continue living a healthy lifestyle. So I got something that would kind of be the best of both worlds and possibly create some more content for the channel as I live locally here in my town of Dalton. So my friends, the grand reveal I want to show to you, a kind of vehicle that's good for the body, but also good locally here in the town. My friends, I got a Moon Cool Tricycle. We'll take a better look at this in a second. And also, I forgot to mention, it'll give me a better opportunity to use my GoPro more often. So let's go take a look at the bike, go for a test run, and see where it goes from here. And here we go. Tell us all about where you've been, Nomad Ben. Tell us all about the finer points of living and your traveling. Food, beer, history, nature, quest. Every corner of the sun to the great Midwest. Tell us all about where you've been, Nomad Ben. So here she is, my friends, the Moon Cool. It's a seven speed mountain tricycle. So I can adjust it to how fast I wanna go. I have two kinds of seats for it, but I decided to kind of get a little bit of a leisure seat for this particular vehicle. Because I mean, I'm here locally. And of course it's a tricycle, it's a three wheeled vehicle. And it has a basket so I could do my local grocery shopping, go for a quick beer run. And of course safety first. I got myself a helmet. And this is what she looks like, my friends. Okay, so now I got the GoPro going. Safety's first. Get a little windy today. But you get the gist. I'll buckle it on my head. Okay, the helmet's on. Let's get going. I also forgot to show the feature. I do have a headlight for my bike here. It's right over there, just making sure everybody could see, because now I switched over to the GoPro. So we're going to go ahead and get going to my local Kroger, uh, because i got to get some groceries. You had a perfect opportunity to test this out. Decided to kind of give the bike a little more of a run in the parking lots of Brewster's, Fiddleheads, and Walgreens. Still trying to get used to this bike. It'll be a little bit. I had some trouble trying to control the bike when I was crossing the streets and trying to control it. It's been a good while since I actually rode a bike, so. Just trying to get back in the groove to actually riding a vehicle in this caliber. That's right. That's right. <laughs> and here we are making it. And here we are made it to my local Kroger. 
All right, I got her locked up. Let's go inside. I just have to come here for one mission, get some veggie straws for my son's class. And here they are, last ones too. And just like that, got me a bag of chips, throw them in my basket, and head home. Make my way behind Kroger, just a little less traffic. And that, my friends, was the Moon Cool bike from Amazon. So, my review on the Moon Cool tricycle. First off, it's been a very long time since I've actually rode a bike. I know I could always, like, you know, go on the bikes when I go work out at the gym. I've been doing more treadmill and ellipticals, really. I haven't been on the actual bike portion. So, I'm a little out of breath, and I still am out of shape, even though I've lost some weight. But this will help me kind of get in a different type of stamina when I'm riding around town. So I do need more practice riding this thing. I know I'm almost I'm halfway to 32 years old, but it's been a long time since I really rode a bike, trying to get to my healthier lifestyle. So, um, so a little more practice uh, where I live predominantly. Uh, it doesn't really have like the safest access to the to the sidewalk, so I kind of have to like make my way to a, a busy street to a sidewalk. And I'll be honest with you, uh, I felt like I was going to wipe out a couple of times, but a lot of it was probably based on my control because I'm a little nervous riding a vehicle like this. It's been a good while, like I said, and I'm sorry I'm repeating myself, but uh, that's why I went over to the Walgreens parking lot, the Walgreens and the Brewster's parking lot, and the Fiddleheads parking lot, so I could kind of gain control of the bike and try to get used to it. So it'll be a little bit till I really get the master, the tricycle, but it was fun for the ride just locally here in town in my neighborhood, and I can't wait to take it in to further parts of Dalton, like downtown Dalton and to Hag Mill Lake, and just stuff like that. Again, I think I need to stay very close to my uh, proximity where I live and get more practice riding this thing before I go any further than I, than I can. I'm just hoping in the future too and my town of Dalton could uh, have uh, safer bike accesses as well. But you never know. Um, but my review of the bike itself, I, I would give it a probably 3.8 out of 5. Um, still a good bike. And like I said, part of it was my experience in, um, but really, uh, it, the 3.5 or 3.8 out of 5 is the reason why I say that. Because when I first bought this on Amazon, it was either a user error or it was things weren't explained well. That I thought the bike was going to come into like three different parts and it was going to be one, two, three, but you had to assemble it yourself. So that's the downfall about this particular bike. So or a tricycle or whatever. So what you need to do, if you are interested in purchasing the Moon Cool uh, off of Amazon, and if you're not really tech savvy or uh, symbol savvy, because the, the instructions, even though they're written in English, uh, the way it was asking how to do it, it's a different kind of English. So, um, so if you have a local bike shop, they'll be happy to assemble it for you, or at least ask. Uh, luckily that uh, there was one in the Battlefield Fort Oglethorpe area. So Battlefield Outdoors Bike Shop actually helped me assemble this bike. 
and they did a good job on it and I recommend them to them very friendly people and um, I'll leave a link in the description below on their business as well but anyways I would say like I said 3.8 out of uh, 5 uh, still a pretty decent score again give me a little more time till I really have true judgment on how I feel about this if this takes me to a bike wreck then I'll probably rec don't recommend it to anyone but it's a very good local get around bike if you only live in town and if you definitely live in bike friendly areas or bike friendly cities or towns this is definitely a bike for you so this the boom cool from Amazon so that's my review on it and I enjoyed going for a ride on it a little more practice will do me good and I can't wait to just do things more locally around here with it so get in more shape than I am in now and yeah just so I can just do local things around here and I can always pack it in this convenient basket anything that I buy some beer some water some food just put it in this little basket be great anyways my friends I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing test drive review of the moon cool bike tricycle from Amazon if you guys enjoyed this particular video give this video a thumbs up shows that you care to you enjoy yourself if you're a returning viewer just new to my channel consider hitting that subscribe button and ring that notification bell below I'll see you guys in some future adventures eat well and keep your mind walking I'll see you guys later I failed to mention that this bike also has a little bell wicked